Hello library friends. I'm happy to be with you today and I wanted to tell you about a very important celebration coming up at the end of this week. On June 19th, we celebrate Juneteenth, which is a holiday that reminds us of the June 19th announcement of the end of slavery in every state in America. It's a very important day. So I'm going to read a book today about that. And the book we're going to read is called All Different Now, and it says Juneteenth, the first day of freedom. So the illustrations in this book are so very beautiful, and so is the story of the people in Texas learning of their freedom and celebrating together. So let's read the story now. This book was published by Simon & Schuster Books. A June morning breeze off the port blew the smell of honeysuckle past the fields and across the yard, and into our room to wake us. And nobody knew, as we ate a little, talked a little, and headed to the fields as the sun was rising, that soon it would be all different. Then we worked and worked and worked some more under the hot Texas sun until word spread from the port to town through the countryside and into the fields that a union general had read from a balcony that we were all now and forever free and things would be all different now i watched my aunt laura as she sang and held her baby mr jake who some say was a hundred quiet, cried quietly and a group of grown people bowed their heads and whispered things to each other I could not hear. My mama held my hand softly and looked beyond as another breeze blew over and everything fell to a hush. But later, Papa, Mama, the aunts and uncles and all my cousins had an afternoon picnic by the water. My baby brother crawled around our blanket as we listened to the sounds of the waves. And as more people joined us, we ate as a free people, laughed as a free people, and told stories as a free people on into the night. What was before would be no more. As we walked back home, the cool of the night soothed our tired feet that padded quietly past the shadowy fields of cotton. And in the morning, the smell of honeysuckle will wake me again beside my sisters and brother, to a time that will be for all of us, all different now. This history is important for all of us to learn more about, so check out our website at ycl.org for many more books available on this topic. Also, our community holds a Juneteenth festival. This year, the festival will be virtual at JuneteenthRockHill.com. Juneteenth is a day to learn more about Black history and culture, so let's all celebrate and promote equality. Have a wonderful day, and keep reading!